and one time only. I told y'all, don't believe that teriyaki 69 dude. I told y'all, stop listening to this dude. He All he do is lie. The whole thing with Adrian Broner, right, and all that stuff they was talking about, he wasn't even in New York. <laughs> Apparently, somebody told me he got jacked for his chain, that jigsaw chain. Somebody ended up snatching it off his neck and running. And then he made a video lying about it, something about some he got robbed. He left it in a cab. He's like, I left it in a cab, and if anybody find it, please reach out. It's real personal to me. Trying to cover up the fact that somebody snatched it. Now, that's what they're telling me. I don't know how true it is, but that's what that's the word around the campfire. Now, I don't advocate nobody stealing nothing from anybody and taking something from people. You know, it's just, that's what it is. You know, these things happen and it's going to get blown out of proportion. See? This flight heading back to New York from Houston. Um, it's kind of a fucking headache right now. I left my jigsaw chain, my saw chain in the Uber, and I just realized right now that I left it in the back seat. Now, if anyone finds it, can you please contact Tribe Drew or William Asher? Um, it's just that that chain means so much to me. Um, and um, I guess I wasn't paying mind to it, but um, if it lands in the wrong hands, you already know what type of shit's gonna go on. Oh my god, this guy is fucking. <laughs> if it's gonna wind up in the wrong hands, <laughs> it was in the wrong hands once it left your possession. <laughs> oh, you look, I left it in the backseat of an Uber. <laughs> You messed around in Houston, and look what happened. And you're not even in New York, and everybody was talking about all this stuff with him and Adrian Broner, and I told you, don't buy it. It's all promotion. You didn't listen. You did not listen. Pretty soon, you're going to realize, pretty soon, you're going to realize exactly what I told you. The guy is nothing but a fake, a fraud, okay? And the sooner you figure that out, the sooner you're going to know exactly what I've been telling you. This all for promotion, everything they do. Now, they went to Houston and something supposedly happened. All I know, his chain is gone. He might have staged the event. He might have staged the entire event. He might have made it, and then he's going to get the chain back. Anything for attention. So you got to learn not to listen or take anything that they say at face value. If people keep giving you lies and feeding you garbage and you keep eating it up, you'll keep buying into it. Now, a lot of you believe that Adrian Broner and them having security at the fight is because of Teriyaki 69 people. No. They worried about a real situation. Adrian Broner. Javante Davis versus the Charlo brothers. <laughs> they entourage. That's why the police are there. It had nothing to do with no Teriyaki 69. He wasn't even in town. He's on his way back to New York now. You see? See what I'm saying? By following these fakes and frauds, and they led by people who are deliberately trying to mislead you, who he got behind him, promoting him and pushing him all the time, and all of his nonsense, and y'all keep eating it up. You're just the key, the KODs J. Cole is talking about. Instead of calling him out and saying, man, why you keep lying, man? You keep, all you doing is trolling, man. That's what y'all need to do. Call these cool, call these fools out for misleading y'all all the time. Call these fools out for lying all the time. Spinning you. Talking about they going to jail. Talking about, oh man, I got arrested. Oh man, I'm finna retire. Oh man, I'm finna do this. 
man, I'm finna run up on dude. I'm finna do that. Tell him I'm pulling up. I'm hitting the streets. Oh, I'm doing this. Yo, we over here. We're doing lean. We got two chicks fighting over us. All of this nonsense they've been feeding you is all fake garbage to have you distracted with nothing. And you keep eating it up. And I don't understand why. So you got to explain to me. Because that garbage, nothing about that garbage is entertaining at all.